Oh, what a lovely, lovely day. Absolutely glorious weather here as we welcome you to a football match of considerable significance. Great consequence in this part of the world. They've been talking about this one for a while and they have uh, rolled up to it in fantastic numbers. You should have seen the roads outside the ground in the hour or two leading up to it. It has been superb goal! It's hardly a surprise, is it? That's what we're here for, a player with this wonderful knack of being able to show up and deliver at important times. Yet, yet another example. A truly wonderful strike, decorated with dip and curl. You know, what was notable in that, Peter, was the fact that he didn't try to blast it. He chose placement instead and delivered a peach. Manchester trail at this early stage. How will they respond? Robertson takes the long option. It's gone out for a throw in. Back to the keeper and try something new. Alexander Arnold. Jordan Henderson. And it's played forward. Doesn't get the pass he's looking for. Salah. Striding forward, facing goal. Shoots! Oh, that's a fine save! Well, you can't ask for much more than that. A difficult moment he simply had to deal with. Chase it out of harm's way. He gets past his man. Dashing forward at pace. He's got through, and it's Cristiano Ronaldo. And that's a foul, three kicks been given. Rashford. Robertson, and it's Mane. Mohamed Salah already, of course, on the score sheet. Lovely bit of skill there. So who's he picking out? Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Oh, it's taken out, that'll be a foul. He knew what was coming. That's a yellow card. Just brushed off the ball there. Has gone out. Fabinho. McTominay does well to read it and intercepts. Has a pop! Oh, poor contact, nothing on the shot. Well, he did get himself into a good position. Something for him to cling to. Tries to stroke it through. He's gone for it! Oh, and they really should have been made to pay. Oh, that was great pressure to force the initial error, Peter. It's the perfect example as to why this is a favourite tactic of a lot of teams these days. And that could be trouble. Gets away from his opponents. Money! Oh, it's hit the post. It's gone in, and it is an own goal. Oh, it's terribly unfortunate for them, and maybe we can attribute that to a, to a loss of focus. So one moment's crazy confusion, but they all count. 
Listen, sometimes you need that little bit of luck in games like these. Done very well to intervene. And they've got it back as soon as they gave it away. Mohamed Salah. Now it's Mane. Mane. What a size of Mane with a shot! A wonderful effort all by himself. Well, at least the crowd are appreciative. We'll try from distance. Hoists it high. Nice little flick. Promising move that. Good inroads into enemy territory, but no joy. He's made sure that that won't get through. Alexander Arnold. Lobs it in gently. And out to safety. Thiago. And we hit half time. Liverpool are two up, and on the balance of things, I would say, deservedly so. They had a very coherent game plan, and if they are... And that's the start of another 45 minutes. Manchester can't make any sort of inroad, despite all this possession. Yeah, he's pulled him up for that challenge. De Gea sends that a long way. And it's Mane. Maguire. Maguire plays it forward. Manchester have it back and they can go again. Some excellent tackling here and that one a perfect example. He's had a shot! Bruno Fernandes. Defenders on the back foot. Bruno Fernandes. He ran himself into trouble there. Free kick given away. And he has taken a dim view of this. A second yellow, and that means red. Well, the protest continues, but in the end, they are defending the indefensible. Liverpool are down to ten men. I just think it was a, a cheap foul to give away. And it's Salah. They're more than happy to take the muscular approach. Moran has got himself a free kick. And no surprise, that's a booking. Managed to get it away. Throw it. And here's Pogba. Fabinho battles to win it back. Hoists it forward. It's a promising ball. Origi. He's good for it. He's managed to get it all wrong. Origi fully deserves the plaudits for setting up the chance. McTominay attempts a clearance. Out to the right. Talk about singling someone out. Yeah, and if they're going to try and stop him in this fashion, Peter, um, they're going to really test the referee's patience from here. Nicely controlled. Ronaldo very firm in standing his ground there. It is a tough full contact contest. Rashford. Good challenge. Excellent challenge. 
Robertson. Forward it goes. Looking for space out wide. Gets the better of his man. Plenty waiting in the middle. Lovely feet. Heave to the back post. The message is... It's one! Oh, just lacked a decent finish. Yeah, on another occasion, all that went wrong, make them right. Some activity down on the touchline. It seems there's going to be a change. Well, you have to feel a little for the player being taken off here. I think he's been made the scapegoat after that, but I guess something had to be done. I suppose it did need a little change. He's away. It's a foul there right on the edge of the box. No, the referees judged that the offence took place outside the area. Yeah, well, they were exposed and, and vulnerable, and he knew he had to do something to prevent a goal then. Got through to him. Mane. Oh, that is lovely football. He's gone for goal. Disappointing finish in the end. Well, it was hit with great power, Peter, but sadly, not great precision. There's going to be another change here. Well, he's worked so hard for his side, uh, as you would expect, but couldn't help notice that he was starting to to labor a bit so it's no surprise Maguire to play it forward Rashford and here's the chance to counter and he's shown him a clean pair of heels he's been taken down and the referee has pointed at the spot Liverpool really could have done without this and the referee has shown him a yellow card Players protesting furiously, but there's little or no sympathy from the ref. Yeah, in truth there, it was carelessness and I think a little touch of panic, Peter, in that challenge. That usually leads to something unwanted. And that's one back! Oh, dispatched with certainty. Well, the keeper probably felt he could read that, but he's guessed completely wrongly. He's gone to the other side. Manchester give themselves a chance of a fairy tale finish. Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. And it's Juan Mata. He's got options out wide. Look, with time running out, they have to get the ball in the penalty box, and if it means a long punt, then so be it. They've got to give themselves a chance. He's found his man. Chance! A read has a hit! Oh, that was nice, but not quite the end product required. It's easy to say it, but difficult to stop it when runs in behind her are being made like that. So here comes the substitution. Yeah, it's pretty obvious as to who was going to be taken off. His energy levels began to, to sag and he was never going to last until the final whistle. There's only one word for this, it, it's baffling. That team needs to figure out where the ball needs to be, and it's not there. And Dyke tries to get it forward quickly. And he's made sure that that won't get through. And the whistle has gone for a reckless challenge there. And that's going to be a booking. Win it by the odd goal. Almost nothing in it. Perhaps a draw would have felt fairer. But that's the game, and they have won it at the margin. So what do you take away from it all, Jim? I thought it lived up to its billing, Peter. Very competitive, open and entertaining. And a little debating room as to whether the outcome was fair.